Huh. What the Amber family considers entertainment looks a lot like what I consider homework. So I guess we missed the reflector. Mm hmm It has to be somewhere on the stage. Yeah. I guess illiterate is the wrong word, so we'll take this. Right? Mm. She's just... Solved it. Durr. She oh, okay. wrote, wrote all the words, but the other way. Exactly, she wrote it like an illiterate instead of writing the literate correct version. Crossword puzzles are. Durr, durr, durr. There's a durr. 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 So clean. I bet Rose would kill it with my mom at the diner. If I open this, will skeletons come spilling out? Let's find out. No skeletons. Lots of shiny dishes. Who has though. red fucking dishes? I would have. You're Why out. Not? I like colorful plates. And I like black plates, for example. Black? Okay. Violet would be Purple, cool. but no red. No yeah. red, no green, no yellow. I mean, fully Sweet red. Fully. About this photo What's wrong with doesn't red? Doesn't seem right. I should mm. fix it. Oh. That's another one. Can't tag this while Rachel's mom is right there. She totally bust me. That's, uh, Can't uh, tag yeah. this while Rachel's mom is right there. So the crossword wasn't anything. She totally bust me. So get rid of mommy. Hi, Rose. Your husband's cheating on you. Pass the ketchup. I guess there won't be ketchup. Hey there, Mrs. Amber. Chloe, I'm so glad you're joining us tonight. This <laughs> look like, don't talk to me. Integrity, honesty, loyalty. What? It's on your lawn. Oh, right. Sorry, I guess I'm still getting used to being an elected official's wife. Uh, what's it like being married to the DA? Much like being married to anyone else, I imagine. But with a lot more secrets, right? Secrets? Like attorney-client privilege and all that. Well, as district attorney, he brings cases against criminals on behalf of the state. He doesn't maybe defend them. Maybe this girl is just of course not. spy. Mm, maybe. So, huh, Rachel was pretty awesome tonight. Yes, she was. Though, to be fair, she's pretty awesome every night. I wish I were half as driven when I was her age. Me too. <laughs> Me too, when it was I get the sense that you're a force of nature yourself. I can see why the two of you get along so well. You can? Because it still seems crazy to me. Uh, what did you think <laughs> of the play? Rachel was typically amazing, but I never liked The Tempest. What did you think of it? To be honest, I only really read a couple pages. Theater's not really my thing. I guess I'm not so into saying words someone else came up with. Fair point. Then again, I'm not sure you can judge the entire art form based on the dead white men your curriculum focuses on. Damn. Shots fired, Shakespeare. So, you putting me to work, or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the cupboard. table. Uh, what if I can't? Excuse me? You said if I could. Never mind. She's stepping into every. You're a riot, shit. Chloe. Yeah. All I'm right, gonna... Chloe. You've set the table without ruining someone's marriage before. Can't tag this. Whole mm. Rachel's mom is right there. 
She totally bust me. Okay, we need to fuck something up. Maybe we don't have to. Drop it. It's off to the table with you. She took one? No. How to drop it? Could have taken a green ones, maybe. Yes, Chloe. Plates, check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? Oh God. I will be a dear. <laughs> Talking to James. As long as I can avoid using the words cheating and scumbag, I should be fine. Something else? What's your vice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. What? Comical. I uh, also Chloe, didn't get it. Maybe you can help me understand something. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we're worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so I unlike her. Some Chloe mode. What do you suppose is going on? You play right away. Besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another joke. You tell me. It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. And you were all too eager to play into our expectations. In my experience, that's a tactic people use to cover for someone else. Rachel is her own person. She's responsible for her actions. I like you. Who are you? I'd be lying if I said I didn't have concerns about your friendship. But, perhaps you're exactly who Rachel needs right now as she navigates the choppy waters of adolescence. That's really like, uh, fuck you move. Thanks. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Taking a note for everything she does. Yes, Chloe? The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. How am I supposed to get to China? Oh. Kidding. <laughs> it's the fancy looking cabinet, right? You got it. We need to find something out. His mother is so fucking stupid. Uh. It's the triangle shaped one. Basic shapes. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. That's a sherry glass. Who would have known? He's at the bus table uh, place, I guess. <laughs> On her butt. What to do? Maybe ask her about puzzles or something. Yes, Chloe? What else? <laughs> Feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. As our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the- It's cool. I've got my own. Oh. You never know when you'll need to light a candle. <laughs> right? You are a paragon of preparedness. Thanks. She's going. I think. Time to light some candles and bless this joint up a bit. 
Finally, Mrs. Amber has her back turned. <sighs> Time to fix this photo. Dracula. Dracula. Good. Good. <laughs> okay, Frankenstein would be fucking awesome too. You light up my light. The Amber family and fire. I was about what to say. What could possibly go wrong? Hmm. You light up my light. So I guess dinner, fight, running away. There was something wrong in this achievement. So, Chloe, are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? We stay friendly, right? Mm -hmm. I wish. Rachel's all honors. <coughs> I'm still trying to get into remedial... What's it called? Vocabulary. What about that fire? <laughs> <laughs> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. Obvious. The way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. The Tempest. Life is... Strange. Uh, it's almost surreal. Hmm. They say a fire like that could only come from a crime of passion. Passion? What does that mean? I don't know. You tell me. Because you're the DA, of course. It's certainly trouble. Uh -huh. Oh. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. Arson? Why would anyone do that? Any number of reasons. With everything going on in the world today, even a town like Arcadia Bay isn't immune to the ills of society. I cannot imagine how difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you. Cool. Thanks. Well said, dear. It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us. Rachel Lode. Family. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. As such, those we love must be cared for Close and never, ever this. taken for granted. Hmm? Chloe Mode, Chloe Mode. Enough of this asshole. Rachel may have to take it, but I don't. I'm going to turn his daughter and wife against him at his own dinner table. <coughs> I'm not sure I agree, James. Oh? I thought you of all people would be grateful for family, at least. A or D? If you ask me, gratitude is just one more way privileged people tell the unprivileged that they should be happy with what they have. That is an excellent point, Chloe. We must always be sensitive to the way our privileges shape our perspectives. Well said, Mom. Still, there must be some room for personal responsibility. I'm sure you agree, Chloe. Uh, military responsibility. When my mom's boyfriend talks about responsibility, it's always code for him trying to control other people. Guess that's why they teach it in the army. <coughs> Careful, we still have See, one to go. See, this is why it's so important to invite diverse voices to when converse with one another. Have it's one absolutely stimulating. Hmm. Highly stimulating. Since you have answers for everything, Chloe, perhaps you'd like to enlighten us with some of your hard-earned wisdom about the world. Always or wake up? Sure. I believe there's always darkness in this world, and it usually comes from the people we thought we could trust. Very well articulated, Chloe. 
I am consistently impressed with how politically aware your generation is. Chloe is an excellent articulator. Excuse me, dear? Chloe's but if this is what makes people so politically aware these days, we're in serious trouble. James, that's unfair and also rude to Chloe. No, I don't believe it is. It seems clear that these points Chloe is making are merely veiled attacks on me. Do you need her attacks? Are you suggesting that I'm using some sort of incognito mode where I can keep my activities hidden? Ooh. That's crazy. Don't worry, Mr. Amber. I can tell that my progressive attitude is not welcome in this house. I'll see myself out. James, Chloe is right. You owe her an apology. I owe her no such thing. I believe she's willfully acting belligerently just as she did this morning. It is how people like her respond to adversity. People like her? So we're profiling now? This is what eight months in the DA's office has taught you. I resent that. My office is committed to fair and equitable treatment. Yes, I've read the press releases. Excuse me? <coughs> Are you calling me a hypocrite? <coughs> Rachel, 